channel my name is Cindy and I am actually starting my weekend vlog today it is Thursday it is October 31st happy Halloween so I've actually been really sick the past couple of days and I haven't like I didn't go to work today and I haven't been able to eat and stuff I think I had some kind of like food poisoning I wasn't gonna go out because I was like sick for the past couple of days so I was like I figured that I wasn't gonna be feeling well enough to go out today um but then last minute I decided that I am going out so I'm throwing together a basic AF costume. I'm gonna be a vampire. I'm just gonna wear all black and do some makeup because I had nothing prepared. I didn't go to the store. I didn't buy anything. So whatever, just gonna make it happen. Um, I usually start my vlog on Fridays, but since it's Halloween, I, st I figured I'd start it early. Um, catch you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, so I'm in my car right now. Sorry for the crappy lighting. Um, it's right now 10:37. It's Thursday. It's Halloween. Um, so this was really, really last minute. I mean, I think it looks all right. I just feel like I made the lines of the veins a little too chunky, but we did it. We're going with it. Um, I did some blood down my body as well, just for extra effect or whatever. Um, right now I'm on my way to my friend's house. That's where we're meeting up. And from there we're heading to downtown tonight. So lots of fun stuff. Alright guys, so it's actually now 4.02 in the morning. I just got home and I'm exhausted. Downtown was super packed. Um, it was mostly a night of just people watching, which was pretty entertaining. Seeing people's costumes and ideas and things. But I will catch you guys probably late in the morning. Hey guys, happy Friday. So it's actually... The afternoon now it's 1 45 ish so about me being sick i honestly think that i got food poisoning i got a chicken philly from jersey mike's i started feeling super nauseous i was on my way home and i was like you know i'm really really nauseous and I, in my head i thought because i ate at 12 and i hadn't eaten i think i ate like one snack in between 12 and 8 i was like maybe i'm just super hungry because sometimes when i'm really hungry i feel nauseous so I was like, let me just go home and try to eat. So I came home and I was hungry. So I ate like a big bowl of pasta. I ate a big salad, some chicken. I had such a horrible night. I was shivering. I had um, a headache. I couldn't sleep. I was tossing and turning, but I was like so, so, so tired because I just worked a 12 hour shift that I didn't want to get up. And on top of that, I was so nauseous and I know my body so well. I was like, if I get up right now, I'm gonna throw up and I don't want to throw up. I woke up and I didn't feel good at all. I didn't feel rested because I didn't really actually get sleep. I was still super nauseous. I knew I was gonna throw up. So I got up, I was doing all right. Like I got up and I was brushing my teeth and then, you know, just brushing my teeth. I started gagging and then I threw up. I'm like, it was, ugh, it was terrible. And then I was like, you know what? I'm fine, I'm fine. Let me just go to work. It's a four hour shift anyway, so we'll just bear through it somehow. So I told my manager, I was like, listen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to make it through the day. I honestly don't know if I will. I'm just giving you a heads up in case I just gotta like book it out of here. So I made it through the day. Like I said, it was a four hour shift, so I just powered through it. So that night I felt like crap. Um, my mom seriously believes I had a high fever. The next morning I was like, I can't do this. I can't work another 12 hour shift like this. So I called out and I slept into like 11. I got like a lot of sleep, so I felt better. And then I woke up, I still had a headache, but the nausea had gone down by a lot. So I was able to eat a snack and I was like, let me start slow. I ate some crackers and then I was like, okay, let me try some soup. Cause the day before I tried soup and like I barely got some broth in and I just, I couldn't, couldn't eat. Um, so I tried soup again and I was like, okay, I'm fine. Then I ordered some food and I was like, okay, I'm fine. And so by the nighttime, I was pretty, uh, not even by the nighttime, by like the afternoon-ish, like around four, I was feeling pretty decent. Like I was myself again, I felt like. I was like laughing, I was chilling, I was walking around the house. Like I hadn't even gotten up the day before. Like I couldn't get out of bed. Like I, like, I was probably super annoying to my mom, but I was like, can you get me this? Can you get me that? Can you do this for me? Can you do that for me? Because I couldn't get up, I couldn't do it. So yeah, so at this point I was just, I was getting up, I was walking around, I was doing whatever I needed to do. And my friend had already told me a couple days ago that there were plans to go downtown, like a group of us to go for Halloween. And I was like, you know, maybe, whatever. I hadn't thought of a costume yet. And um, 
the day before I was like, I'm probably not gonna be going because I'm sick. So she like tried to convince me and like whatever. And I was like, I am feeling better. So I was like, I'll go, but I'm not drinking. I was like, not putting anything in my stomach that was gonna make me throw up at this point. In case you guys are wondering what I'm eating, sorry. I'm actually eating some leftover Pollo Tropical grilled chicken, fried yuca. Fried yuca is amazing. Their cilantro garlic sauce. If you haven't tried it, you are missing out on life. That stuff is so good. And I told you guys I don't drink soda very often. I really, really don't. Like, this is going to be the first time I drink soda in like two weeks, I think. But I got some Coke and it's in my butter beer cup because Harry Potter is life. So yeah, now I'm going to eat. being hot <laughs> I've asked her three times to be quiet hmm? <laughs> alright guys hey so happy Saturday it's 10 20 Saturday morning right now um, I woke up got ready didn't really do much just kind of you know fake it till you make it but right now, I want to go to a couple stores, a couple things I need to get. Um, but yeah, catch you in a bit in the stores. Hey guys, so it's right now about 11.40 in the morning. Just got out. Oh, okay, so I didn't vlog inside because I was so focused on what I was doing and what I was getting. But I'll do a little mini haul once I get home. Hey guys, so it's right now 1 o'clock. Stop for some on-the-go lunch. The current setup on the go <laughs> chick-fil-a is life if you've never had chick-fil-a you need to find somewhere and go get some chick-fil-a and eat their fries and the chick-fil-a sauce it will change your life hey guys so i wanted to film kind of like a little haul of everything that i bought yesterday um i went shopping in a couple different stores including sephora ulta ross i went to the mall i went to best buy so the first thing that i actually want to show you is from Best Buy, I got a tripod. So this is the tripod. It's called the um, Joby Gorilla Pod, and I got the 1K one. So it came automatically with the phone adaption, which is the one that I'm using for now until I get a camera. But anyways, this is the first thing I want to show you. I will be showing you the rest in just a sec. All right, guys, so the rest of the stuff that I got, I'm going to start with Ross. So at Ross, I got, first off, I got this kit brushes and it's called the Eco Tools Confidence Bloom Beauty Kit and it comes with nine um, brushes in it. So Eco Tools is a brand that I have used before. I have a couple of these and I use them on the regular. So I went with that. Um, then I got two shirts. So I got this body. It's a black body. It's like kind of turtleneck and it's uh, like some striped material super stretchy i feel i had i didn't try it on but i feel like it's just gonna be like that tight um long sleeve kind of look i can put it on with some like ripped jeans and some boots super cute and then i got this really cute hoodie light hoodie so it's black <laughs> once again but it's a uh, kind of a cropped hoodie but it's not like super loose i feel like it's gonna fit me just right and then the sleeves and the shoulder area is this like netted material. So I feel like I'll just wear like a sports bra under it, a cute one, like a strappy one. And then it's got a hood. And that's all I got from Ross. Then we were at the mall. There was this one small store. It's the first time I've been to that store. So we just walked in, me and my mom, to see what was in there. And I bought this dress. 
just a casual dress. It's got that, um, show you guys. It's got like that cut off style at the top. And it's got like these little buckle thingies. I figured I can just put this on with my Converse and a jean jacket and make a cute outfit out of it. Super casual, super comfortable. Um, after that, let's go with Sephora. So from Sephora, I only got two things. I actually went there after going to Ulta, so I had already gotten a bunch of stuff. Um, so the first thing I got from Sephora is the, their Kat Von D eyeliners were on sale, so of course I was gonna get one. I got the Kat Von D Ultra Ink Liner, which is a flexible felt tip liquid eyeliner in the color Trooper Black. I've actually never used any of the Kat Von D products. I've heard that their lipsticks are amazing. I've heard that their eyeliner is amazing. So I went ahead and grabbed it since it was on sale. And then I also got the Anastasia Beverly Hills, what is it, Luminous? Luminous Foundation in the shade 360C. Um, so I haven't actually used any of these products yet. Right now I'm just showing you what I got. If you do wanna see my first reaction to them, watch my previous video. Um, it was a get ready with me and I used all my new makeup. So there's that. And that's all I got from Sephora. So the rest of my shopping was all done at Ulta. Got a bunch of cool stuff. So I already took this out of a packet and it's in my purse. I got the mini lip plumping duo from Buxom and the colors are White Russian and Celeste. So I got these. I also got It Cosmetics Confidence in a Gel Lotion. It says Hydro Plumping Skin Transforming Weightless Moisturizer. 72 hour hydration. So I really needed a new moisturizer to put on before doing my makeup. I went ahead and got this to see how it does. And then I got from ColourPop, I got their, I don't know if you're supposed to say the name twice, like it's on there twice. Stick Sticks. I got their Stick Sticks blush. It's a stick blush. Um, and then it says on the glow. But yeah, I got this because I finished slash broke my Tarte blush. And it's in the shade 25.8. Um, so this one's called the You're So Jelly Jelly Highlighter. It's in the color Bourbon Bronze. And this is what it looks like. Um, I've never even heard of a jelly highlighter. So let's see how this works out. I also got the Morphe Micro Brow Pencil in the color chocolate mousse and then so the very last thing I got which is also like the biggest thing I got I got the Morphe James Charles palette so I actually got the mini palette it's the exact same colors it's just in a mini version uh, I figured that actually be smarter decision for me because I'm not I don't imagine myself running through these colors. I'll probably get bored of the palette before I do that. So I just got the mini and I'm super excited to open it. I haven't opened it yet. Uh, super, super excited for this. But yeah guys, that's all I bought. It is sometime in the afternoon on Sunday and right now I'm getting ready to film. This is why I look like this instead of having gotten ready because it's a get ready with me. So, you know. I'm gonna get ready in the video. So anyways, I'm gonna go and start setting up to film and then film my video and then, honestly, I'm gonna get ready for nothing because I'm not gonna do anything afterwards. But I'll check in with you guys after that. Hey guys, so it is, the, I don't know what time it is. I know I have a watch on, but it's dead. It's sometime in the, that's how it looks outside in Florida today, right now, evening-ish time. That's the best I can do right now. And I am so annoyed. Hmm. Guys, I'm so annoyed. So, I'm trying to record the video that I'm trying to put up next, which is the Get Ready With Me video. And I had my setup and I was doing everything and it was going just fine. Right now, I just, you know, have some foundation on, which by the way, <laughs> looking good. 
Anyways, so then my camera kept turning off. It started from the very beginning and I'm like, I don't know what's going on. So then it did it again and this time it popped up, you know, update, storage, manage here, whatever. And so I'm like, all right, let me try to fix this. So I'm trying to fix it and I'm having to jump through so many hoops to record this video right now. And I'm so, so annoyed. And like my makeup is half done and now the lighting's going to be thrown off because I started in the daytime with the nice sunshine light right on my face and catch you guys in a little bit. All right guys, so I made it work. I filmed the video. It, it actually should be up before this vlog. So if you wanna see how I achieved this look, let me turn on the light so it looks better. If you wanna see how I achieved this look using the James Charles Morphe palette, go ahead and watch my last video. All right guys, so with all of that being said, this is the end of this weekend's vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all of your support. If you like this video, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please make sure that you subscribe, turn on that post notifications, and I hope you guys had a good weekend. If you haven't already seen my latest video, I'll also link that down below. And thank you guys so much for everything. I'll catch you on the next one.